landed in Moscow. Just got into our hostel. It's in the back alley. Our room is small as we imagine because it's only $50 Canadian a night, but it is so hot. I thought there'd at least be a fan in here. There's only a heater. We just stopped at the local food vendor. Don't know if we got ripped off, but that's fine because we needed some boiled dumplings called pelmeni, and we also got the okroshka, which is a kefir based soup of stuff. Hello again, this is me, uh, this is Ari and uh, Cecily, they are from uh, Vancouver, Canada and uh, we have just done the Moscow Kremlin tour. Uh, the guys are for the first time in Russia, in Moscow. We, I'm, just, I'm so inspired of, uh, of the guys of their trip, uh, of, uh, that uh, they are two more persons who now I know from the Canada, Vancouver. My favorite neighborhoods were Artplay and Red October. They're both creative hubs in Moscow. Artplay was very inspiring and filled with design studios. We sat at this really cool vegan coffee shop for about three to four hours. There's desks there welcoming you to bring your laptop and hang out. We also spent one afternoon at Red October. It's filled with creative types of people. We enjoyed working in a large communal space there. We're about to head into a traditional Russian banya. Um, there's absolutely no reviews, especially English reviews, and the treatments are really expensive. Uh, Two hundred and seventy dollars per person for a three-hour package, which I mean that's pretty normal for a package, but not when you're on a budget. Uh, yeah, and uh, seems pretty freaking awesome, but we just don't know if we're gonna get scammed here, so we're gonna go check it out. But it looks we bien. I smell dirty feet, and I look down through some. No more stinky feet. Punch balls. I wonder how it went for Cecily. The scariest things I've ever done. It's hot, and they put these two fur leaves over your face and I'm claustrophobic. Oh. <laughs> oh, the Russian bunny. Oh, very nice. <laughs> I like that a lot. <laughs> this, tea, this tea very strong. You need to make a... Uh, half. Yeah, half. You always have to remember that they're the ones standing above you. Well, I know. <laughs> I, was, I didn't know if I was going to make it through. <laughs> Relaxing. Recommend it to anyone. Okay, we got the city bikes. Oh my god, it's like the nicest grocery store I've ever seen. Oh yeah? Got Whoa. Sour cream, radish, dill, cucumber, like the legit stuff that yep. we've been looking for. And I know you wanted a Greek salad and it's actual real looking feta. Okay. Does that look really good? Yeah. And then I thought maybe we'd have ourselves a little wine. Great place to have a picnic. Miss Cornet keeps trying to get her. Ah! Here's our spread. Today we're headed off to the Museum of Cosmonautics, celebrating Russian space history. I'm gonna see all what it's all about, and I'm really excited for this. Been on my list for a while. Космические карты и штурман уточняет в последний раз маршрут. Давайте, ребята, споемте перед стартом 
У нас еще в запасе 14 минут. Я верю, друзья, караваны ракет Помчат нас вперед от звезды до звезды На пыльных тропинках далеких планет Really excited to go on a kind of a more adventure trip on our next country in Kyrgyzstan and really excited for all that nature that we're going to get into and it's also going to be cooler so I'm very happy that the temperature will come down. It is? I hope so. No, I'm well, I don't know. <laughs> it might be 30 days.